Hi there. Welcome back to the channel Learn English with Namrita. Today I have brought a very interesting topic for you. Today I am going to talk about human sounds. I know you are aware of their names in Hindi but I am going to give you English vocabulary for these sounds and I am also going to discuss how to deal with the situation when your body produces these embarrassing sounds. So the first one is belch or burp. Burp is a slang and belch is a formal word. It means to expel gas noisily from your stomach through your mouth like uh. So this is burp. It might be unpleasant for you but it is completely natural. And if you burp loudly in front of someone and feel embarrassed, you can say I'm sorry, the food was really delicious. The next sound is hiccup. Hiccup is sudden involuntary contraction of your diaphragm. Now what is diaphragm? It is the muscle that separates your chest from your stomach. So these hiccups are also normal. If there is someone who is hiccuping a lot in front of you, you can say, "Would you like to get me some water for you?" And if hiccups are driving you nuts, you can use this trick: plug your ears while drinking water, so your hiccups will go. Often this works. Now next is the most embarrassing sound: fart, also called flatulence or passing gas. It is passing of intestinal gas through rectum. Now we don't like to admit it but we all fart kids especially find it so funny and if you want to be less farty try cutting back on foods like beans onions or fried foods and if you fart accidentally in public and no one got to know about it just pretend that you did not do it and if it was loud apologize say sorry or excuse me But my advice is stay away from these kind of situations try to avoid it Fourth sound is sniff sniff has two meaning sniff means to detect a smell or taking short quick breath of air in to stop the liquid inside your nose from flowing out For example the detective sniffed around the house for clues or dogs sniffed the ground or the lady kept on sniffing and wiping her nose so the etiquette is if you find someone sniffing due to cold you can hand over a tissue now next is also an annoying sound it is snore we snore when during sleep air cannot move freely between our nose and throat air flow is constricted and it creates a vibrating type of sound like Okay so if you are snoring in your sleep it is an indication that you are not sleeping well now i cannot tell you what to do when you are snoring what to say because you are in deep sleep at that time but if later someone brings it to you someone tells you that you snore you can say sorry and you can seek help of a medical professional next sound is slurp it is the loud sucking sound that we produce when we are drinking or eating something For example she slurped her milk in three slurps or he slurped his milk in some countries slurping is considered normal for example chinese enjoy their tea when they are slurping it they take all the aroma but in some western countries it is often considered rude to slurp in public so avoid slurping in public places and if there is someone who is sitting right next to you and slurping tea loudly so you can just avoid it and pretend that you did not hear it now the next sound is groan we groan when we are in deep pain or grief for example the groan of dying soldiers groan of a wounded man who was being lifted groan of someone who was struggling to carry a heavy object so this was about groan now the next sound is sigh in hindi ah it's like when you release a breath of air it expresses sadness relief or tiredness for example his parents let out a sigh of relief so it's long audible breath of air you release breath of air now another sound is gasp now this is opposite of sigh in sigh you release air and in gasp you take short quick breath of air in when you are shocked or you are surprised uh, like this <gasps> So this sound is produced for example you saw uh, some accident on the road so you might have trouble catching your breath or maybe because you are so shocked that you gasp ah this sound so now isn't it getting boring 
So this is yawning. Yawning is a reflex act of opening one's mouth wide and breathing all the air, filling your lungs with air because of tiredness or boredom and it is contagious. Even the thought of doing it might cause you to do it and even videos of people yawning can cause a yawning session. So these were the 10 interesting sounds for today. In the next video, I'll come up with another 10 interesting sounds in English like tisk tisk or cracking one's knuckle or clearing one's throat. So if you like this channel and if you have already subscribed it, thank you. But if you haven't, please press the bell icon and let me know that you liked it. Thank you. Have a nice day.